Hi guys, welcome to today's video. So I attended an amazing beauty event in London on Thursday. My friend Tatiana was also invited, so it was a lovely opportunity for us to catch up. It was actually in Chiswick, which is somewhere I've never been before, so it was actually a little bit further than I realised. However, the event itself was lovely. I got to learn all about the Emmeline brand and we were able to have our lipstick chosen for us by a makeup artist. I had my nails done and I desperately needed to have my nails done. They were, I was actually embarrassed. They just looked so terrible. And uh, yeah, there was lots of yummy food and drink, which is always a bonus. And I met so many nice people. There were other content creators there. So it was really nice for us to kind of get together and chat. And also the team at Emmeline were also lovely. And I did get to meet Emmeline herself, who is the founder of the brand. And she has to be one of the most fabulous people I've ever met. So yeah, all in all, it was a really amazing event. What I like about the brand is that they cater for all skin tones and there's just such a wide variety of shades. So whether you're looking for a fabulous red lipstick or a nude or you want some really like vampy nails, they really have got it all covered. They're just a lovely brand and one that I definitely wanted to support. Hi guys, it's Friday morning. Josh has just gone to school. I am all glammed up, ready to go to London. I have been invited by Max Factor to attend Stylist Live. It's an event that I've never been to before and they gave me a plus one, so I invited my mum. So I need to head out the door, go to the train station, we're actually going to London a little bit earlier than the event. We want to do a little bit of sightseeing, a little bit of shopping. I think my mum wants to buy herself a new Chanel perfume. She really likes Chanel 19, so we're going to go and hopefully get that. And then, yeah, we will go to the event. So um, I need to stop talking and let's go. For my outfit today, I'm wearing this gorgeous new jacket from Karen Millen. I'm wearing an extremely old top underneath. I know it's an Italian designer, but I can't remember which one. I am wearing my classic Levi skinny jeans, my Doc Martin boots, and that's about it. For my earrings, I'm wearing these little Chanel CC studs and my handbag, let me go and get it. And for my handbag, I'm using my classic Lulu Guinness. Right, let's go. I was going to get the bus, but because it's not raining, I decided to walk. It's really not that far from where I live. That's right. Snuggly on the train. <laughs> I've wanted to go to Italy so many times but I've been a bit intimidated there's often a lot of people waiting outside so there's a restaurant downstairs which is where we had our coffee but you can obviously have a full meal and then upstairs is the food hall it had such an incredible selection of produce everything from cured and dried meat to fresh fish lots of cheeses panettone it was just incredible I could have actually spent hours and hundreds of pounds in there i didn't actually end up buying anything but i wish i'd got some olives because my son really loves those 
and also that pistachio crunchy paste. I know that that would be delicious and who could say no to truffle flavored crisps? Also, these coffee machines are so cute. I already have one, but I wouldn't say no to one of those. And then it was nice to see Molden and Colchester oysters in there because that is pretty local to where I live. I definitely want to come back here before Christmas. I saw so many gift ideas for my husband, my mum, my dad, my brother. It was just such a lovely place and a real experience to walk around as well. How cute are these elephant statues? There are actually quite a lot of them around. I just think that they're so lovely. And it's just great that things like this are all over London. There's just always things to look at and new things popping up to see. But uh, one thing that was expected was a Costa Coffee trip. We always go. I'm just browsing in and other stories. I had no idea that they sold fragrances, but this whole section of body care, beauty, fragrance was amazing. I definitely need to do some more research. This was our main reason for coming to London today. Max Factor invited me to the Stylist Live. This is an event that you can purchase tickets for and there's lots of stalls where you can meet brands, you can sample products, you can buy products. It's just a really nice day out. I actually went ahead and purchased the bottle of this wine. It was so delicious. It was a classic Sauvignon Blanc. and They did have a rosé, but I preferred the white. I will definitely be featuring that in an upcoming video. There were also ways that you could win prizes so they had this like little machine unfortunately both my mum and myself we didn't win but I did win some Josh Wood goodies and I'd also won a Rituals body shimmer I had to stop by the Max Factor stand. They had such an amazing selection of makeup and it was just so nice to talk to the girls there. Obviously, they were the people that invited me and I know that there was a fashion show that was taking place and there were lots of talks. I think the day that I was there, Caroline Barnes, the makeup artist, was going to be giving a speech, but I couldn't stay for that, unfortunately. Um, and I think on Sunday, Emma Willis is going to be there. It was just great. We were given these cocktails. It was just a really nice afternoon out. Um, I learned about this brand from Vogue Williams. This is her self tan brand called I think it's just called bear and their products just smelled so good there was lots of little indie brands and then the carry who is actually a brand I've worked with in the past I was able to finally meet Ginny who is the owner so it was just lovely to meet people in person particularly as a lot of the relationships that I have in the beauty industry were formed during covid so it's nice to be out and about and actually see each other so there was beauty, there was food, there was drink. It was just a great day out and I highly recommend it. I hope that you've enjoyed my video. I'll be back on Wednesday with a new one. Bye.